Now, forewarn weather with Exact Track 4D. Speaking of winter wonderlands, Ta-da. our resident <laughs> ski expert switched to. Uh, Switch to a snowboard, which you'd never Very done good. before. No, never Live done it before. Live tonight at six. Yes, took a big risk. Yeah, we, we applaud you. No crutches. <laughs> no crutches. I didn't wipe good. out the group of a ski school sore, students. Though, right? right as I was about to ski down the hill. These little ski school, <laughs> like, so I mean, they couldn't have been too. more than five years old, like <laughs> little ducklings cute. go right in front. I'm like, yes, oof, oof, <laughs> These, oof, yes. Oof. These are your 1934, or I mean, 2034 Olympians out right, there getting exactly, there. Exactly, <laughs> right. I know, as, as the, the little ones just speed right past me. Uh, but it was a lot of fun out at Mount Brighton, and I know they're so excited about the snow we're expecting midweek next week. Detroit 34, Howl 32. We got a little snow today, just kind of off and on here and there, but it certainly felt and looked a lot more like winter, which has had not in the last several days. 31 in Mount Clemens, 30 in Pontiac, 34 Metro, 35 City Airport, exact track 40 radars. Pretty quiet tonight. There might be a flurry or two, but that's going to be about it. And by the time you wake up tomorrow morning, uh, we do see a few holes in the clouds at 7 a.m. So if you're an early riser or you get up to walk the dogs, you might see a break or two of the sun. But notice how quickly the clouds fill back in again out ahead of our next system, which comes in for Sunday morning. Here we are at 5 a.m. Some snow showers start to move up from the Ohio Valley and continue across Metro Detroit throughout the morning hours and then tapering off in the afternoon. And snow totals could, I mean, we could get a little bit, maybe an inch or so in most spots. We'll tweak this tomorrow. Watch Brandon in the morning and Brian tomorrow evening. They'll have more on exact totals. But, I mean, we might get a little dusting to about an inch or so here in Metro Detroit. But the big snow comes midweek, 5 a.m. Wednesday. We start to get some snow, at least now. It's still pretty early, but this is what we're expecting as of now. 10 a.m., we're still under snow, and we get heavier snow as we head into the evening hours Wednesday, and then it's gone by Thursday. But it might be the kind of snow you need to shovel. 26 degrees, cloudy and cooler overnight tonight, daytime tomorrow. 35 degrees, lots of clouds, especially in the afternoon. Winds out of the southwest, 5 to 10 miles per hour. Sunday, we get that quick uh, accumulation of snow, just light, 35 degrees. And then Monday, sunshine highs in the upper 30s, near 40 for Tuesday. So we're not quite done with the relatively mild weather. But then Wednesday is the day that we are all going to get quite a wake up call as we get some snow showers yeah. in here. The big news really for these ski resorts, though, is that uh, they can start making snow again yep. Yep. the end of the week. Even though we've had temps in the 20s, they need humidity at a certain level as well. Yep. So they haven't yep. been able yep. to do that, yep. but it was still fun. Yeah, yeah. you look, look good like out it. there. Yep.